A line has a slope of negative 3 fourths and goes to the point 0, 8. What is the equation of this line in slope-intercept form? Slope-intercept form. So any line can be represented in slope-intercept form as y is equal to mx plus b, where this m right over here, that is the slope of the line. And this b over here, this is the y-intercept. Y-intercept of the line. Let me draw a quick line here just so that we can visualize that a little bit. So that is my y-axis. And then that is my x-axis. My x-axis. And let me draw a line. And since our line here has a negative slope, I'll draw a downward sloping line. So let's say our line looks something like that. Let's say it looks something like that. So hopefully we're a little familiar with the slope already. The slope essentially tells us, look, start at some point on the line and go to some other point of the line. Measure how much you had to move in the x direction. That is your run. And then measure how much you had to move in the y direction. That is your rise. And our slope is equal to rise over run. And you can see over here it would be downward sloping because if you move in the positive x direction, we had to go down. Our run, if our run is positive, our rise here is negative. So this would be a negative over positive. It would give you a negative number. And that makes sense because we're downward sloping. The more we go down in this situation, for every step we move to the right, the more downward sloping will be, the more of a negative slope we'll have. That's slope. So that's slope right over here. The y-intercept just tells us where we intercept the y-axis. So the y-intercept, this point right over here, this is where the line intersects intersects with the y-axis. This will be the point 0, comma b. And this actually just falls straight out of this equation. When x is equal to 0, so let's evaluate this equation when x is equal to 0. y will be equal to m times 0 plus b. Well, anything times 0 is 0. So y is equal to 0 plus b, or y will be equal to b when x is equal to 0. When x is equal to 0. When, when x is equal to 0. So this is the point 0, comma, b. Now, they tell us what the slope of this line is. They tell us a line has a slope of negative 3 fourths. So we know that our slope is negative 3 fourths. And they tell us that the line goes through the point 0, comma, 8. They tell us we go through that. Let me do this in a new color. I've already used orange. Let me use this green color. They tell us that we go through the point 0, comma, 8. Notice x is 0. So we're on the y-axis. When x is 0, we're on the y-axis. So this is our y-intercept. So b, we could say, well, we could do it a couple. Our y-intercept is the point 0, comma, 8. Or we could say that b, remember, it's also 0, comma, b. We could say b is equal to 8. So we know m is equal to negative 3 fourths. b is equal to 8. So we can write the equation of this line in slope-intercept form. It's y is equal to negative 3 fourths, negative 3 fourths times x times x plus b plus 8 plus 8 and we are done we are done